now that you are all set up, let's get started. What are stunts? Stunts are activities in a form of play that test your agility, flexibility, balance, strength, and endurance. There are three classifications of stunt. First is the individual stunt, which is performed by one person. Next is the dual stunt or paired stunt. It is performed by two persons. And third is the group stunt, which is performed by three or more persons. But for this day, we will only be discussing the individual stunts and dual stunts. Let's go! Let's proceed to the dual stunt. But this time, I have a big help from your art teacher, Miss Marian. She will be my partner in demonstrating the stunts for you. Now get ready and grab a partner. Let's start with the ring the dish cloth. Partners stand face to face and join hands by raising partner one's left hand and partner two's right hand and lower the other pair of arms. Partners turn under raised arms then end to a back to back position. They turn under the newly raised arms to come face to face again. Repeat the whole process a number of times. Keep your hands together all throughout. Let's try it out! Next is the double walk. Partner 1 and Partner 2 stand face to face. Both grasp each other's upper arms. Partner 2 steps on the right foot of Partner 1 and Partner 1 steps on the left foot of Partner 2. When everything is balanced, slowly Partner 1 walks forward and Partner 2 slowly walk backwards at the same time. Let's practice it! Another one is the bouncy ball. Here's a video on how to do it. Partner 1 acts like a ball. He takes a squat position, weight on the balls of the feet, and arms wrap around his knees. He bounces by springing on the floor with the feet. Partner 2 stands beside Partner 1 and bounces him like a ball by gently tapping on the back. Partner 1 bounces forward keeping completely curled throughout the stand. The spring is continued rhythmically while the bouncer taps the ball. Let's try it! The next dual stunt that you will perform is the Chinese get up. Or should I say, ready, go! Partners stand back to back. Both reaches and locks each other's elbows. With small steps, they walk a little away from each other and sink on the floor. They finish sitting back to back with their legs outstretched on the floor. To rise, partners should keep the arms locked, bend the knees, 
and bring the feet close to the body. With coordination, push each other's back at the same time to come to standing position. Let's do it! Finally, the wheelbarrow. Partner 1 takes a prone arm support position. The knees are straight and the body weight are laying on the hands and feet. Partner 2 stands between Partner 1's feet and lifts his legs off the floor. Partner 1 walks forward on hands keeping the back straight. And Partner 2 moves forward as though pushing a wheelbarrow. Let's try it out! You did it! Congratulations! Job well done! Now that you know the various movement activities or stunts, just remember! Performing stunts develop your body posture, coordination, strength, flexibility, agility, and balance. This is also a good form of exercise to keep your body healthy and enjoying at the same time. Patience, perseverance, and cooperation are some of the characteristics you need to successfully perform each stunt. It tests your concentration while communicating and cooperating with your partner. It helps you discover your abilities and that goes also to your partner. You learn to respect the strengths and weaknesses of others and become aware of the need for cooperation. Did you understand and learn a lot today? If so, try to answer the following questions. 